Pioneers. Happy Friday. It's Toga Day. Thanks for tuning in to the ORTV News Show. I'm Athena. And I'm Thor. We hope you had a great week at school. Now let's hear about what's going on this, work, this week in world news. Meat lovers, put down that burger. There is another recall of ground beef, but this time it's over nationwide. And 6 million pounds of beef, um, 47 people fell ill this summer after reading ground beef product. The meat is said to be contained with salmonella. Previous recalls were issued for meat contaminated with E. coli. E. coli. It's probably the best you stay away from ground beef until the new year. SeaWorld and Busch Gardens are working hard to get you back into their park. SeaWorld just opened up a new ride called Infinity Falls. The ride will be a Whitewater Rapids Level 5 simulation. They are offering annual pass deals that require down payment as low as $9.99 per month for all three parks, SeaWorld, Aquatica, and Busch Gardens. Universal is also getting in on the fun. Their new annual pass program is offering guests up to six extra months of their park experience with the purchase of a pass. Currently, the annual pass lasts 12 months from the date of purchase, but now they say they want to give you an extra half a year to visit all three of their parks. Pass holders will receive many benefits depending on the pass, including the following. Universal Express after 4 p.m., early park admission, free self-parking, invites you to exclusive events, discounts on specially priced tickets to events such as Halloween Horror Nights, unique experience, additional discounts throughout the parks and more. Homecoming festivals will continue throughout today and tomorrow. We will have a pet rally this afternoon during 7 p.m. as well as Friday night football game versus university. Pioneers, you had a great <laughs> great week of festival. Yesterday was a pimp named Earl anchor our morning show along with salt from the <laughs> rap duo Salt and Pepper. Flavor Flay was spotted on campus as well as some of the hippies and old school rappers. Let's keep that same energy up while we trash the university cougars. And don't forget that the dance is Saturday night in the gym Let's end this week with the bang. Pioneers, have fun. There are a dozen of ways to get involved here at Oak Ridge Teachers. Please send your announcements through the morning, your announcements through the morning show so you so your students can get involved. Hi Pioneers, my name is Lorene Householder and I am in charge of the 21st century after school tutoring program. It begins on Monday, August 20th, uh, and it goes all year to the last week of school. We had great results last year. Everyone is welcome to attend. You get a free meal, and we even will give you transportation home in a couple of weeks. But for the first few weeks, um, you definitely need your own transportation because the buses have not been set up yet. My office is in the administration building. It's 101F as in Frank. You can come, ask me any questions. But on Monday the 20th, we'll be out on the patio by the cafeteria and we'll be handing out applications and you can sign up and stay the very first day. But remember, first couple of weeks, no transportation. Thank you. The Fall Chorus Bridge concert will be held in the auditorium Tuesday, October 9th at 7 p.m. It will feature performances by six Oak Ridge High School choirs, as well as guest performances by Memorial and West Ridge Middle Schools. There is no cost, so come enjoy the event of music performed by your peers. SAT tutoring is gearing up. Make sure that you get as much, as tut much tutoring as possible. Go to your guidance for more information about how you can take advantage of these opportunities. 
Tutoring for Ms. Rosa DeCamille DLA Reading Class and Ms. Catherine Montez ELD Class will take place in room 5308 every Tuesday and Thursday from 2.30 to 4.30. It don't matter no more. So my man said over there, it don't matter no more. When you, sit, when you look at you 0 and 2, that's in the past. Them two games, can't do nothing about it. All you can do is take what, we, what the information that you got from those games, what you did wrong, what you could improve on, what can be improved, that's all we can take with us into this next game. The two games behind, you don't think about them, don't think twice about it, don't think about whether or not you dropped the ball, whether or not you could have scored another touchdown, don't think about none of that. None of that matters because it's in the past. That's all that matters, the fact that it's in the past. But the main thing that you gotta remember is that thoughts become things. Thoughts, your mind is such a powerful tool. For now, that's all the information we have for you. But keep us updated by filling out the news announcements form and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching the ORTV News Show on Layout Grinch High School, where we are one team with one goal, pioneer our way to the day. Have, have a, a great, great weekend. weekend.